Ravinder Raina said the BJP supported the imposition of governor rule in the state. Jammu, Jammu and Kashmir BJP President Ravinder Raina today claimed to be getting death threats from Pakistan since the last two days, I have already informed the state governor Anand Vora and the security agencies about the threats. The calls were made from different Pakistani cities including Karachi, Rawalpandi and Muzaffarabad over the past couple of days, Mr. Raina was quoted by news agency PTI, Director General of State Police SP Vaid said no formal complaint has been received so far from the BJP president. The BJP president said that he will not be cowed down by such threats, what matters for me is my nation, my country, my motherland and the tricolor. I am a soldier of Bharat Mata and the BJP and will continue to work for the country and the state and will expose the nefarious designs of Pakistan. The development comes days after the BJP pulled out of an alliance with the People's Democratic Party PDP. Mr. Raina claimed that, in one instance, a terrorist had called him and said he would meet the same fate as journalist Shujit Bukhari, reported news agency Ani. Mr. Bukhari, 50, along with his two personal security guards, was shot dead by three motorcycle-borne assailants outside his office here on June 14. They are desperate and frustrated, they are making such ridiculous calls. We will never spare Pakistani, Wallace, terrorists, and I challenge them and make it clear that they will not be spared and killed. Security forces have been given free hand to deal with them, he said. He said it is an act of cowards after the BJP exposed the nefarious designs of Pakistan which claims to be an Islamic country. During the Ramzan ceasefire, it killed innocent people like journalist Shujat Bukhari and broad daylight and soldier Chowdhury Aurangzeb who was abducted and assassinated while going to his home to celebrate Eid. He said, adding earlier too many people like the SP Muhammad Adayab was lynched on a holy night at Jamia Masjid in downtown Srinagar besides several other police officers and civilians. He said he had exposed Pakistan and made it clear that it is an anti-Islamic country. Pakistan is a nation of coward people and I raised anti-Pakistan slogans in the state assembly.